Get your special discount offer on the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com slash video. Sometimes businesses want to vary an item's price when selling the item to different customer types. For instance, you may charge different rates for residential customers versus commercial customers. You can associate price levels with specific customers so that each time that you create a sales form for the select customer, QuickBooks will use the appropriate pricing level when calculating rates and amounts for the line items listed within the sales forms. Now you can also associate price levels with specific line items within a sales form if desired. Now using this method, you're only discounting specific items in a sales form, not all items for a specific customer or type of customer. So price levels make it easy to use different rates for line items within sales forms without having to calculate percentage amounts manually. Price levels can affect amounts for service, inventory, and non-inventory part items only. Also note that price levels are only a feature of QuickBooks Pro or QuickBooks Premier. In QuickBooks Pro, you can only set price level discounts as a flat percentage. If you use the QuickBooks Premier version, however, you can set price levels for various quantities of individual items if needed. In this lesson, we'll examine how to create basic price levels in QuickBooks Pro. To access and create price levels, first open the price level list. You can do this in QuickBooks Pro by selecting lists from the menu bar and then choosing the price level list. Now to create a new price level, Click the Price Level button in the lower left corner of the Price Level List window and then select New from the pop-up menu. That will open the New Price Level window where you enter the information about the new pricing level that you're going to create. So start by entering a name for the new price level into the Price Level Name text box. You can then choose whether this price level will increase or decrease item prices. You can then input the flat percentage by which you would like to change the item prices. You can also choose how you would like to round the prices. When you're ready to create the level, simply click the OK button and that will add it into the price level list. Now as with your other lists, you can select an entry that you've made and click the price level button to edit or delete entries if needed in the future. Once you've created your pricing levels, you can then either assign them to specific customers in order to apply a selected price level to all future sales to this customer by default, or you can apply selected price levels to specific line items in your sales forms manually as the need arises. You can apply a default price level to any customer when using the Edit Customer or New Customer windows. So first you would need to open the, item, or the customer list. And I'll give a double click on this customer in order to open the Edit Customer window. On the Additional Info tab, you can set a price level for that customer by using the Price Level drop-down to pick the pricing level that is desired. In the future then, all calculations made in sales forms for this customer will use the pricing level assigned. Once again, to complete this, go ahead and click the OK button to save your changes. You can then close the customer center. So if we went to create an invoice for that customer, you can see that it changes the price automatically. Also if needed, within a sales form such as this invoice, you can click into the column for the rate or the price each and use the drop down to select a different pricing level on a per line item basis if needed. Now this allows you to manually set pricing for selected items in a sales forms, if preferred. 
Once again, once you've used the pricing level as needed, just save and close it. Like what you see? Get your special discount offer on the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com slash video. Over two dozen titles are available in Microsoft Office, QuickBooks, Photoshop, and much more.